Hello everyone, welcome back to a brand new video today. Honestly, I've been thinking about making this video for a while because if you guys used to know, I was a huge fan of Fortnite back like a few years ago when the game first came out. I was one of the OGs and there's gameplay on my channel to prove that. I don't like to prove anything to anybody, but if you guys want to know, it's on my channel and it's it's pretty bad. Uh, the gameplay is really bad. I, mean, I don't think I even talked in it. It's just straight up gameplay and uh, it's here. It's a thing on my channel if you guys want to go check that out. I'm not going to link it or anything. I don't want to remember those days. But Fortnite recently to me, it's become a laughing stock of a video game. I honestly don't know how this game is still popular and even a thing at all. It's all over Twitter still. Well, it used to be all over Twitter. Fortnite to me now is just a game that I don't see how people play. You know, I would rather play Valorant than Fortnite. And you guys know how I feel about Valorant. That I already made a whole video about that. And a lot of people disagree with my opinions of Valorant. But I would rather play that than Fortnite right now. I played Fortnite a few days ago, you know, just to get the Deadpool skin. Because I actually never got the skin didn't care enough to get it but I got the Deadpool skin and when I played you know I was having a little bit of fun playing I'm not gonna lie but then I realized the game is the same it's always been in the last few months this is literally the worst Fortnite season I've ever played and it's not gonna get any better you know if they go back to like season three or four you know, maybe I'll play the game again or if they bring it back to its original state when the game first came out that they're never gonna do I'll play it I, I miss the old Fortnite so that's what we're gonna be talking about in this video it's just how bad Fortnite has become. We're going to react to some streamers and just, we're going to do all that in this video. So this should be pretty fun. Go ahead and drop a like and please do subscribe. The support recently has been honestly crazy. And I, like I say this in every video, but I thank everybody for the support. It's been insane. And the gameplay in the background, it's from an old game, you know. We got some Force Unleashed gameplay right here. We got some Fallen Order gameplay from the new update that just got released. And if you guys want me to make a whole different video of talking about the Fallen Order and stuff like that, and what I think about the sequel, let me know down in the comments, because I did make a video on Battlefront 2, and I did talk about the Fallen Order in that video, so that could be something I could do, but man, I don't know who still plays Fortnite, realistically, there's people all over Twitter that talk about it, I still follow all the people that play Fortnite, like Face Way, they're just completely addicted to it, man, they, they just can't see past how bad the game is actually is and they're somehow still playing it you can't play fortnite nowadays without there being tryhards and people who think it's arena trying to earn money for playing the game when most of them really aren't there's so many tryhards on that game now it's literally not even fun i remember back in the old games when everybody was bad at the game including me i was awful at the game i didn't start getting good to like season four or five and then after that it just it went completely downhill man i would say i was above average at fortnite but i want to hop on it recently i could say that I'm nowhere near the skill level that everybody is now. And it's honestly kind of sad because I did enjoy it for a while. I played it almost every single day. But then recently, the last few months, nah, just haven't touched it, man. I played like the beginning of the newest season. Got to like, what, tier 63, level 65, something like that. Quit playing it. Completely just do not like Fortnite anymore. And it's kind of sad because that's how I got big on this channel. I joined aggro and, you know, I, I got big off of Fortnite. I mean, the Fortnite community really helped me out. I'm not going to lie about that. You know, Call of Duty Zombies community is where I started, but the Fortnite community, man, that's where I grew at. And now I just do commentaries for YouTube. But I'm not going to lie, I've seen more success with commentaries than I have ever in the Call of Duty Zombies and the Fortnite community. And like I said, I thank everybody for that. I have wanted to make a Call of Duty video again, just haven't had the right time to do it. I am working a lot now. And I work pretty much every day of the week, and I just don't have enough time to make videos like I would want to. But the support on the videos that I upload are unreal, and I'm just glad of where I came. Fortnite, yeah, it helped me out. I'm not going to lie. Fortnite did something to my channel, and it got a lot of viewers on here. And I know I lost a few viewers, because when I did upload Fortnite a lot, Any ideas? all those viewers that watch Fortnite yeah, don't watch my new videos now. And that happens with everybody, and that's one thing that I have a complaint about, man. These people that get big off of Fortnite, Faceway just hit 3 million subscribers, and it's honestly, when I saw that, I'm like, good God, man. The people still watch this guy, you know? Like, how is he still relevant? How is the game still relevant? I will never understand. Faze Jarvis was complaining. He was crying in that video. Everybody's seen it. I'll put it up right now. I'm so disappointed in myself for doing this and not thinking about, like, the consequences that could have happened. No. He was crying in that clip because he couldn't play Fortnite anymore. But honestly, if you can look where he's been, he doesn't need Fortnite at all. Dude gets still gets like a million views a video 
And honestly, he wouldn't want to go back to Fortnite in its current state. Anyway, everybody's been telling him that, like, man, you're not missing anything. You know, when you got banned, you got banned at the best time because this game is complete dog shit now. And that's one example of somebody who just got big off of Fortnite and he could still make it here on YouTube. Like, he doesn't need Fortnite anymore. Everybody watches him for him. Well, he's supposed to because he's in phase. That's what I think about Phase Sway. Dude hit 3 million subscribers, still uploads those shitty montages, and him fast building, which honestly, who cares about that anymore? No one should care about that. I don't know how that's still a thing on YouTube. I see so many people upload these montages, them fast building and 1v1ing people. Is that really what we're doing still in 2020? Those type of videos? I just do not understand. Like, who, who actually enjoys watching them? Anybody in the comments let me know if you actually enjoy watching clips like that or videos like that they're like a minute long with some overused song in the background with them free building that every other fortnite player does it's just completely boring to me and i don't understand now i am friends with a lot of people in the fortnite community um, i'm friends with a lot of people in aggro still and you know those people did do videos like that and i'm not really talking crap on those type of people if you want to do a video like that sure i just think it's personally boring watching them myself you can do whatever the heck you want i, I really do not care I just don't understand how people can watch them. And people are getting big off of making these type of videos. I wish I was good enough at Fortnite to do something like that, man. Just make a two-minute long video with a crappy song in the background that people's heard a thousand times. Of just building nonstop, building fast, editing fast, and just shooting people 1v1s. I wish I could do that, man. I, I really wish I could just get big on YouTube by doing that. But then the thing is, what happens after Fortnite finally dies? Which I don't know how it hasn't died yet. I wish it would. What happens, you know? What are these people going to do? Are they, are they still going to be playing Fortnite after the game's irrelevant? It's going to get, like, no views a video? Faceway's going to go from, what, a million views video to probably, like, 100k after Fortnite dies. I'm just making an assumption, you know? The dude still might get a lot of views after Fortnite's not relevant anymore, which it really isn't now, but, you know, people still somehow play it. No one really talks about it anymore. People talk about Valorant more now. And I honestly would, like I said, I'd rather people talk about Valorant than Fortnite because it's just gotten to the point where Fortnite's been around for like four or five years now, man. It's time to quit the case on the game. It's time to end it. Just close the game off together and let the game die out in a good way. That's pretty much what Epic Games is doing now because when I played it, they didn't add anything since the last time I played like four months ago. They didn't update it. They didn't add a thing to it. It's still the same game. They're just pretty much at this point focusing on Arena and you know people that play for money that's the only thing that really epic games really cares about now they haven't added any new skins from what i know i haven't seen a youtube video or wow crazy fortnite update i haven't seen one of those in god knows how long because the game's just not popular anymore people are trying to make it a thing people are trying to say this is the best game ever bro those are like 12 year old kids because the game's not no I, I literally my niece her brother plays Fortnite every single day, and he's like a nine-year-old kid, you know? He plays this game every day, thinks it's like the best game on Earth. But that's the only people that play Fortnite now, it's just a bunch of eight-year-olds. Nobody that's over the age of 14 plays Fortnite and likes it. I I've never seen anybody play it. My buddy is really good at the game. He's got over 600 wins, and he's done Arena before and actually earned money from the game himself. And he does not even play Fortnite anymore. Like, the game is just complete dog shit now. And I just don't understand. But, you know, this isn't going to be the only video. This is the end of the commentary, but we're going to go ahead and react to some clips from your favorite Fortnite YouTubers. Let's see what's going on here. Let's let's crack some laughs. Let's make fun of them. And this, this should be great, man. I think the first clip we're going to react to has got to be one of the free building clips that I just mentioned in this video, man. Well, let's go check out these skilled players unique videos original content man you never see anybody upload stuff like this let's go check one of these free building videos out man let's go see how great these people are at making youtube videos <laughs> like the video in the next five seconds if you love your mom now i just want to say no hate for the creator of this video this is seven he used to be an aggro with me and me and him were really good friends back when he was an aggro he's in bh now and he's actually done a lot for himself and i'm kind of glad it where he's came we're just gonna go check out this video real quick and react to it but yeah no hate towards seven at all he was one of my buddies back in aggro and i completely respect him I how you pull up, baby? How you pull up? This fifth one in here is Cloud. 
I mean, honestly, you guys are looking at this clip. Is anybody this good at the game? Like, Seven, he's a pretty good dude, and he's honestly really good at the game. Like, honestly, get kind of jealous that people can do this type of stuff, man. Like, I wish I was this good at Fortnite. Like, jeez, man. Let's go. Brand new Lamborghini, fuck a cop car. With a pistol on my hip like I'm a cop. Never met a real nigga rock star. This ain't no guitar, this is a cop. Now, I will admit one thing about this little video right here. This is put together really well, and I do like the song in the background. It's not one of them generic songs like that you usually hear. Um, this is a the baby sound that just came out, and I actually really do like this song. I have actually never heard it before, so this is something unique. And like I said, seven, he's always made unique style montages, and I did say that a lot, a lot of people do make unique style montages, and I'm not gonna be biased just because he was my buddy at one point. No, but a lot of people do make unoriginal bad montages that aren't even sunk up properly but this one's actually not too bad but we should go ahead and check out some of the montages that are really bad and trust me there is a lot of them please like the video if you genuinely enjoy it my god yeah you know this is gonna be a great video when it shows that cancer fortnite intro in the beginning like the video if you genuinely enjoy it most people in montages say that at the beginning of every video that's something i've noticed people say the same exact thing no one's original man like this is ridiculous seven said it in his video and now this guy is saying it like come on dude yeah, I get it. You have to have an intro. I do the same thing, but people just copy each other and no one really talks in montages. This is the easiest content you could ever make. Like I said, I mean, I am jealous. I wish I could do this, man. You don't even have to talk for a video. You just make a montage. You can't really hate on that. I mean, they're getting the bag. They're chasing the bag, dude. And it's something I wish I could have done, honestly. Oh my god! Oh my god! No, this isn't such a bad montage. It's just nothing sunk up, dude. There's shots in the background are way too loud, and nothing is sunk up. That's what most of these montages are. Are just complete trash that aren't sunk up with just a song in the background. I have seen too many of them at this point, but this isn't a bad montage. If this guy edited it, you know he didn't do too bad on it. It's just, dude, like I don't understand how people can make these, man. How do they have fun making montages? I will never understand, man. I'm just gonna go ahead and say it, man. This is a terrible montage. I mean, yeah, the dude's got good clips in it, and I'm not trying to hate on him at all. I'm just giving him a little bit of advice. Dude, just sync up the music next time. Pick a better song. Like, I don't know what this song is, but it just doesn't work for Fortnite, dude. It's not a bad song. Yeah, okay, it's a pretty decent song. It just doesn't work for what you're trying to achieve here. You're not syncing any of the shots up. This is what people do, man. Anyway, this is gonna be the end of the video. I've honestly had enough of watching montages now, and that's just, just what people do on Fortnite nowadays, man. I just wish I could've. Anyway, guys, this is gonna be the video. It's been Iroh. I'm signing out. Peace.